That's cute. That must be uh, runway seven right. Happy. Well, I'm not for that. Those cut. What the? F Look at that. How can you crash there? How can you crash there? Sucking beyond belief, that is. Radio tower on the runway. There shouldn't be anything on the flight path. That's why it's a game. Maybe there's a fence here or something, but it, I'm not that low. It was around here. Oh my god, don't crash on me. He did it again. Did you see that? What am I hitting? Not a race car. I've been impressed with the scenery, but I'm not impressed if this is something to do with it. Never had this problem before. Around here. Of these roads. Great, if it doesn't, if it doesn't happen, great. I'll turn around and uh, do an approach. Definitely clear everything, I'll make you yeah. Oh, there we go. Bingo. What is that? There we go. Absolutely nothing in the sky. Okay, I'm now going to repeat the test with the uh, scenery disabled from Aerosoft. This is the default scenery. It's the highway. As soon as we go over the highway, that you it's not the like this here, got us. And clear. Because here, boom. No such problem now. Okay. Okay, well, I, I wrote to Aerosoft and told them about this uh, glitch or bug and they suggested that I turn crash detection off which goes against all my ethos for flying the simulator in the first place. So we're back to the Aerosoft uh, scenery. You can see the uh, racetracks there. I mean, it's great scenery. Exactly second highway what's gonna happen nothing uh, nothing then. okay crash detection now is on coming to land at seven seven left I haven't tried different heights but as it's quite normal for someone to make a mistake coming low. I would say this is too low. And the spot. Oh, it's gonna work. It's not gonna work. Ah, we go. What is the invisible barrier here? 